Okay, KB2MXV, uh, D578, A side is on National UHF Simplex, the B side is on Local DMR Machine on Torque Group 2. I'm going to be using my 878 to Torque Simplex into the crossband repeat mode here, and I'm going to call one of my buddies who's on the Local 2 DMR Machine. This is KB2MXV on UHF analog simplex crossbanding to talk group 314267 on Brandmeister uh, to the VXB TWA machine uh, K3VNN. Do you have a copy on DMR side? K3 VNN, on the draw, over to you. K3 VNN, you're sounding good on my side. Uh, my portable is locked into UHF Simplex National Calling Frequency, and I heard you fine. Um, and I'm also monitoring you on my open spot coming in, and I'm watching the D578 doing crossband repeat for me. Okay, very good, Frank. I am uh, talking on a local DMR repeater. Not going through any hotspot or anything like that. Uh, DMR repeater connected to the Brand Racer network. And uh, you say you're Crossbanding analog DMR, that sounds uh, really good. I don't hear any <coughs> audio clipping or any drops. Uh, sounds really good. Good. All right, Kev, very good. The only uh, drawback I see to this is uh, my portable that I'm using for crossband. Uh, I don't get to see your display, your DMR ID coming over, obviously, because my portable is on uh, analog. But I just wanted to confirm that this works. I'm going to be uploading this to YouTube. So I'll say 73s and thanks for coming back to me. KB2 MXV for your final. Very good, Frank. Uh, good job. Appreciate the videos. Love watching the videos. And uh, look forward to uh, testing out some more. KB2 MXV from K3 VNN. 73s will be clear. And there was your crossband.